Hi guys, so today is all about my Lush haul. I went there, um, I think it was like, not last week and weekend, just before, because it was my one of my best friend's birthdays and I saw something on Fleur de Force's YouTube channel about a really cool bath bomb, so I thought I would go and investigate, plus I'd stuck up on a few things myself. But I must interrupt my haul for one special moment because look who is next to me fast asleep. Oh, she's got her eyes open. That is my mum's dog, Annie. She was in my last video as well, making a guest appearance, but she's a bit knackered. We took her out for a walk and she is dog meat now. But she's adorable and she was really intuitive as to what I was doing earlier on. But, um, all right, back to Lush. <laughs> no more dog talk. So the first thing I got I'll put little pictures up as I go through of them. Was the Golden Wonder Bath Ballistic. This is one that Fleur put on hers and I saw it and it was incredible. I actually went in to get this for my friend but I bought one for myself. It looks like that. It's like an actual little present which is ideal for sort of her birthday. It's out for Christmas but um, it's gold as well. You can't actually see how gold it is. It's really shiny and glittery. It does get all over your hands but it smells amazing. And when you put it in the bath it changes colour. And you get like little gold stars come out and stuff. So I can't wait to use that. I'm just waiting for the right, right time to use it. The second thing I picked up while I was in there is the Twilight Shower Gel. Very apt for this time of year with the finale of the Twilight Saga coming to an end. It comes out today, but I'm going on the 7th of December. I have made sure I've got plans for that. It's a limited edition shower gel with lavender and malt notes, um, aiming to calm, relax and comfort you as you transition from day to night. It does smell lovely as well. Mm, I could just sit there and smell these things all day. But that's really cute and uh, it's nice they do this little size. This is like 100 grams, so it's like a little tester pot, but for me it's ideal when I'm going away travelling. Not that I do that too often, but I'm actually going to Cambridge this weekend, so I thought I'd take this with me to have a shower. Um, so yeah, if I like it, I'm probably going to end up buying the full size one, but I just like trying new things as well, that's why I get little samples. The third thing I bought was, I actually bought two of these, they're Melting Snowmans, oh, Melting Snowman Massage Bars. I haven't used these before, but I also saw these on Fleur's thing. Oh no, we've got a casualty. He's lost his head. His head, he's having floating head snowman syndrome. Right, if I pretend that his head is attached, that is what he looks like. He's so cute. He's got like a little orange, orange peel nose, I think, and like little buttons. But his head is actually, his head has fallen off. So yeah, that's my massage bar as well, which is pretty cool. It's really soft. And it smells like Christmas. It's got like nutmeg in it, I think. That's what smells amazing. So I've got two of them, so they'll last me a little while. I might give one as a present. I'm a bit undecided, but I just thought I'd pick a couple up while I was in there. Um, and my final one is something that I've never tried before, but I've heard loads about. It's um, the Comforter. It's like a bubble bar. Like you break pieces off it and you pop it into the bath. But it's, I couldn't resist the smell of it. It just smells like a sweet shop. And I don't eat sweets much, but I'd rather smell like them. But look at that. It's bright pink and white, and it just smells incredible. You, can, you literally think it was edible. Yeah, place the, crumble the bar under the hot running tap to allow the bar to something, mounds of bubbles for you with no effort on your part. I can't read it because it's faded. But you basically break a part off the bar. He said like about a third, but I reckon with these you can get away with quarters. And he showed me how to do it in the shop and you put it under boiling water and it just foams up really quickly and smells of the smell of this. So that's definitely worth the money. That's a little bit more expensive, but it's kind of, you're getting like four for one. So it's really good value. So that is another incredible one. There you go, that was the stuff I got from my Lush haul to show you guys. Not much, but there was enough to keep me occupied for a little while. Um, there should be some more haul videos coming up soon, because I'm going away for my birthday, as I said, to Cambridge, and I'm hoping to grab a few bits from there. I'll um, pop all the information I've popped on the pictures in the drop down below, just so you can have a little look there. So keep your eyes peeled for more videos up and coming soon, and guys, go to Lush if you want to perk yourself up over this cold winter. It just smells amazing when you walk past it, let alone when you get inside and buy things. All really reasonable, all sort of mostly natural products as well. Um, the place in Norwich is really helpful, really nice people in there. 
So if you're new to it all, please go and investigate because it's wonderful. So take care, guys, and I will see you all soon. Bye.